All right, hello, Die Castle friends. Welcome back. And today we are going to be uh, looking at a very cool uh, Matchbox five pack cakes. You got fleas and disease, sir. Oh, you do? Is that why you're scratching like a maniac, sir? Okay, can you tell everybody, hey? That was not a very good hey. What kind of hey was that? Tell everybody, hey, sir. All right, I guess if that's what we're going to get. All right, guys. So anyway, today we are going to be looking at this very cool Matchbox uh, Blue Highways 3 5 pack here with cakey snakey for a minute then we're going to give him some treats and we're going to put him out so we can look at these cars a little bit better so anyway let's first off take a look at the uh the artwork on the back very neat guys and as you can see it is this truck here and that truck what is that called uh is that the international scout 4x4 in this very cool looking blue so anyway let's give cakey roo a couple of treats and then we're going to get right into this video family all right okay you want a couple of these treats let me see if i can set my camera over here on the bed maybe you guys can see hopefully i'm not sure what kind of view you're getting right now but we're going to give cakes a couple of treats and then we're going to get uh, right into this video. So while Cakes has his treats, let's take a look at a couple of the cars that I have over here. New background for you guys for my Halloween stuff, little Jack uh, Skeleton. What's this right here? Oh, this is a, a 2021 Ford Bronco Matchbox truck. Very cool model. Let's take a look at some of the cars that I've already unboxed and that we have uh, reviewed while Cakes has his little treat there. You guys say what's up to Fred. <laughs> He's the guardian of the uh, the light switch there. Yo, what's up, guys? Yo, you like my uh, like how I'm rocking? You like how I'm rocking my beanie? Got that high top right there, kicking fam. <laughs> All right, I think he's finished. We're gonna take a quick look at some of these cars over here. All right, guys, I'm gonna put cakes out, and we'll be right back to get into this matchbox it's five pack. Stay tuned. Kicks, tell them bye. All right. All right, families. So here we go. We have the Blue Highways 3 uh, Matchbox 5 pack. Let's take a look at what we have here on the side. So we got the Polaris Slingshot, man. I see these things around town all the time and in some crazy cool colors, man. I want to get one of these. I almost want to get one of these and use it as my uh, like main uh, form of transportation, but... You got to do a lot to modify them to put a roof and windshield and all kinds of things on them. Plus, during the winter, man, you'd be freezing in that thing. So anyway, the next one that we have here is the Dodge Viper RT10. Very cool. Then we have the uh, International Scout 4x4, the one I already showed you. We got the Mazda MX-5 Miata. And then we have the 1969 uh, Camaro SS396. So anyway, why these are all called blue highways is they're all convertible where you could take uh, the, the tops are off for cruising uh, down the road on a beautiful sunny day down A1A with your top let back. So very cool. Let's open this set up and we are going to take a look at each one of these uh, individually. Okay. All right, let's get them out of here. All right, now the first one that we're going to look at, we're going to go straight up to the top here with this uh, Polaris Slingshot. Let me get that out of there. All right, it's a very uh, cool model. As you can see, it is in this very neat blue. Got some very cool uh, chrome wheels. Now this is, look at the seats and this, uh, the shifter in there. So we have a very cool uh, and detailed interior there. You can see the shifter. I'm not sure if that's the e-brake or what. Look at those seats. Now, very cool how it has these side pieces that kind of hug you to hold you inside of the vehicle. Neat little uh, windshield on here. Let's look at the other side of the uh, interior, see what we can see. Very cool model. I like the seats in these things. Very cool. 
little door panel. So you just kind of step into it uh, here through the side. Got a little single wheel on the back because it's a, a three-wheeled vehicle. Very nice looking model in this blue. Like I said, I wanted to get one of these to uh, cruise around and use it as my daily driver. But then I was like, man, that thing's probably uh, just too impractical. It'd just be like a little weekend warrior toy. Look at the headlights on that thing. But anyway, very, very cool little three-wheeler. Wheeler, uh, neat little model. And there's the bottom of it for you guys. All right. So moving right along. The next one that we have in the pack is the Dodge Viper R. Uh, T10 very neat looking casting um, now Hot Wheels redid their model and they put side mirrors on it made it look more uh, realistic here for 2024 but this is the uh, the matchbox model and I believe that this one looks uh, very good too look at those uh, bronze style five spoke wheels one of my favorite uh, matchbox wheels so we got uh, tampos on the rear got the little uh, Viper RT10 uh, little uh, snake head there going on the back. Cool little uh, windshield, like a roll bar thing. Got the snake here on the front on the hood. The best thing about this car is that big old long hood, man. Making this thing look like a King Cobra or something. Very aggressive model. The side uh, pipes on it. That clear windshield. Let's see if we can see the interior a little bit. Let's go to the other side. Yeah, you can see the little shifter steering wheel in there. Got the little gauge cluster. Very cool model. I always love the uh, Dodge Viper. Little uh, rear wheel drive. Little super bad uh, sports car. All right, the next one that we have here is the, the International Scout 4x4. And I already showed you this one here in a red because this one came with the uh, Warren Winch pack. And now we have it in a blue. Let me uh, grab the one uh, real quick. Oh, All right, and this was the one from the Warren Pack in uh, red here. Very cool model. Let's compare it with the uh, let's compare it with the blue. You guys, tell me what you think. You guys like the red or the blue? Are they both a good combination together? I think they're a great combination together because here you get the white. Here you get the chrome, you got the red with some graphics on this one, you got the blue with the with the black here. Very uh very neat models indeed. I'm going to set that one up there for uh, just comparison. No way I can read that. I can't tell what that says at all, but we definitely uh got the uh the tail light tampos, tags to scout there. It's like a nice heavy duty steel bumper. Little spare tire in the rear. Got the um the sun visors folded up. You guys can see the little steering wheel inside this thing. Nice seats. Very cool uh, model. This is the Scout. The headlights, the little dual pipe uh, uh, front bash bumper guard. Headlights. Nice little grill. Very cool. Uh, very cool little truck. And, uh, of course, it is convertible because this is the Blue Highways 3 pack. Now, the next one we have is this Mazda um, Miata, the uh, MX-5, very neat model, very cool in red. You can't go wrong with a little uh, sports car in red. And uh, nice because we have uh, Tampos here on the rear. Very cool. You can see the Mazda 5. And then the uh, you can see the little Mazda uh, logo there. Tail lights. Got the little... Um, backup lights is that the backup lights not sure what that is looks like uh this little tag holder right there very neat interior on this got the bronze five spoke wheels that you can't go wrong with see the little transmission the exhaust pipe coming out of the back right there very cool stuff and you have full uh tampos on the front so very cool model this little miata you guys let me know what you think of the uh the mazda mx5 miata I think it's pretty neat. I'd love to drive this little car around. All right, last one in this pack is the 69 Camaro SS with the 396. It's got a pretty good size motor in it, and it's got this brownish, goldish paint job with these twin, uh, very thick racing stripes. Check out the interior in this one, guys. 
got the little cover for your uh soft top i believe it's a soft top could be a hard top but it's definitely got this leather cover here to protect it probably unsnaps and you can uh pull it out latch it down here to your window nice uh little three got that little winged uh hub cap nice chrome uh ring around the rim there cool tires neat i think it says uh no i'm not sure what that says i thought it said ss but it doesn't very cool uh, back bumper. That'd have been cool if they would have put some uh, tail light tampos on this. No headlight tampos on it either, but you can see the recessed grill there. Got this little uh, air dam on the front here. Very cool model. Uh, very nice in that real metallic, uh, shiny gold. All right, so that concludes this uh, Matchbox Blue Highways 3 5 pack. You guys let me know which one was your favorite. We're going to take one more look at these cars, and then we're going to wrap up this video, guys. I say cars, but cars and trucks. That slingshot, man, very cool model. Little Viper action. Mazda. Over here, we got that uh, Camaro. Got the Scout. And then we have the other Scout that I put up for comparison. Very cool trucks. Yo, this is Brian with the Die Castle. I appreciate you guys being here. I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you have an amazing day. We out.